Peace in our school means to encourage others, to be selfless, respecting other people, to forgive others, including everyone, kindness, looking past differences, embracing differences, bringing everyone together. Peace in the community looks like helping the needy. Being friendly to complete strangers. Interacting peacefully with neighbors. And working for your community. Sadako Sasaki. Sadako Sasaki was a pacifist. She was born in 1943. She was two years old when the bomb was dropped. Amazingly, she survived the bomb for 10 years. She was one mile from ground zero. She was exposed to radioactive rain. She excelled in many sports and wanted to be a PE teacher. She liked to run. But in 1954, she was diagnosed with leukemia. Then she started to make a thousand paper cranes. Then her legs swelled. She asked the teacher if she was going to die. When she was eating food, the last word she said was delicious. She died in 1955. She never finished making a thousand paper cranes. Every year, children make a thousand cranes to celebrate her memory. She is now a symbol of peace in Japan. Wangari Mathai. Wangari Mathai was an activist. It made a difference. She was born on <clears throat> April 1st, 1940. She grew up in Nairobi, Kenya. She got a degree in biological studies at Mount St. Scholastic. She also got a degree of Master's Science at University of Pittsburgh. She got a PhD at the University of Nairobi, which she also taught veterinary anatomy. In 1977, she started the Green Belt Movement, an organization dedicated to improving women's livelihood. And an increasing access to natural resources. With the Green Belt Movement, she planted more than 35 million trees. In 2003, she was elected in Kenyan's parliament. She was appointed assistant minister in the Ministry of Environment and Natural Resources. Sadly, in 2011, she died of cancer. She inspired people to fight for what they believed in in peaceful ways. Cesar Chavez. Cesar Chavez made the National Farmers Workers Association. He organized Filipinos and Mexicans to protest together peacefully. The farmers got paid a dollar an hour and could hardly afford their own food. Cesar Chavez was, spoke to crowds to uh, teach them the peaceful ways to earn their rights. Cesar Chavez was a great speaker even though he never went to college. He brought dignity to farm workers. Take these sunken eyes and learn to see all your life. You're only waiting for this moment to Blackbird fly, blackbird fly into the light of a dark black night. Blackbird singing in the dead of night. Take these broken wings and learn to fly. Singing in the dead of night Won't you take these sunken eyes And learn to see All your life You were only waiting For this moment to be free You were only waiting For this moment to be free You were only waiting <laughs>